about the gold sky ha ha everyone hates tesla here we are back with a tremendous rocket launch i'm gonna show you guys the footage stay tuned because this joint is about to get crazy all stations verify ready for launch fts fts down Prop. props go abi go. gnc pnc go Guys, there's no company better than SpaceX right now. We got Elon doing some of the best things you have never seen in the world. Now, it wasn't too long ago that we weren't good at rocket technology at all. Tesla was behind, the Russians were killing it, the Chinese were killing it, and now we're killing it. USA, USA. And first of all, I want to say congratulations to everybody at SpaceX. This is Starlink. Guys, we can provide internet anywhere in the world. As you've seen, the Cybertruck. We're in the future already. Elon Musk. Everything is Elon Musk. This is a new era for Elon Musk. Tesla, SpaceX, XAI. Everything is going to the high. It is going to the stratosphere. Today, we're going to be talking about private markets because most people just know that they could be investors in Tesla, but they don't know that they could be investors in SpaceX also. So I'm just going to show you a little video about some of the platforms. Now, in order to make these type of investments, you need to be an accredited investor. And credit investor has a couple of requirements, but here's one of the requirements. At least have a million in net worth. And that's not including your primary residence. So most of you know is gonna be like, oh, my house that I live in with my family, that's worth a million. No, not including the primary residence. So if you got liquid funds, whatever, stocks, et cetera, this is gonna get your net worth, reducing your liabilities, and then you get the net worth, right? Add and subtraction. After that also, there's another requirement. If you make 200,000 per year, for the last two consecutive tax years and with the projection to do it again next year as a single household then boom you have that and that's of course a two-parent household or a two-family whatever right you with your partner spouse wife whatever you guys together could be three hundred thousand. so if you're making at least let's say you know a hundred and fifty then your partner's making 150 there you go but if you're by yourself it's two hundred thousand. and the same thing for two consecutive years on the tax returns with the projections to make it also in the future. There's some other things that qualify people, but it, it, we don't need to get into that. What I'm going to show you right here is basically a platform. It's one of the many platforms that's available that kind of opens the gate to get in, into the private markets. Most of the things we talk about is stocks like Tesla. That's open on the public market. So you just open up a Charles Schwab or a Fidelity account. And you could basically purchase stocks in a publicly traded market. But these private markets, well, they used to be very hard to get access to because you had to know the companies that had access to the connections to get maybe the shares from employees who wanted to sell off and liquidate. Maybe they were paid underneath their contract with the company in salary plus some you know, stock options or stock awards. And so they own that equity and they can't go to Charles Schwab they can't go to Fidelity and sell them to the public. Like, so if they got paid Tesla for, you know, Tesla stocks or stock awards and options during their time working at Tesla, then they could just easily sell that on the platform. But with private companies like SpaceX, they have to find other marketplaces or other companies to go to in order to sell their stocks. And that's if the company is not buying back. Some companies buy back. They have a right to first refusal on some of these stocks. So again, let's just tap in. I'm gonna show you one of the platforms so you guys can just know it. Maybe you become an accredited investor today. Now, hopefully watching this channel and investing in whatever stock you invest in, hopefully you'll get there one day. Let's go. There's a massive amount of wealth locked inside the private market. Right now, there are over 700 companies worth a billion dollars or more. Together, these unicorns have a market cap of more than $2.3 trillion. In addition, the overall private market is expected to grow by 85% to $13 trillion by 2025. The time is right to disrupt and remove the barriers in the private market. At Forge, we believe the private market future is today. Woo! 
Ooh, nice video, guys. But that's a lot of money right there, right? The, the market for the private industry is massive. 700 companies worth 1 billion or more. Now, check this as of now. Imagine when these companies go public, if they decide to go public or if they just have mergers and exits. This would be great for investors who invest in the early stages of these companies. Now, that's a lot of money and that's massive amounts of growth. You know, 2.3 trillion just currently, but projected to be over 10 trillion by at least 2025, 13 trillion. That's an 85% growth, right? And so these private companies, they might not have much transparency like a publicly traded company, but at the end of the day, it is a frontier of investing that most investors are not up to understanding and being able to navigate. Most people are just not familiar with this type of product. And so this is one of the platforms that, you know, of course, provide that opportunity and facilitate you being able to make those purchases. $13 trillion by 2025. The time is right to disrupt and remove the barriers in the private market. At Forge, we believe the private market future is today. Now, I read a great book. It's called Democratizing the Private Market. Democratizing, excuse me, the private market. It was a great book. And it really spoke about the private markets just opening it up in the future because most people just don't have access to it. And it's just being more accessible to people who don't, you know, traditionally have the options to invest in it. Now, of course, there's still some re uh, regulation and legislation that doesn't allow everybody to be involved in it. But I think that it will be good for the masses to at least understand about you know, private markets and how they could eventually in the future be a part of investing into that market. And again, companies like SpaceX and et cetera are all different type of companies that are private. So I'm going to bring it up here on the screen right now. Excuse me, I've just been typing it in. But democratization of the private market, right? Facebook, Uber, Robinhood, they were all private companies at some point. And historically, there has been no way for investors to easily buy and sell shares in the private market with the introduction of blockchain technology, digital securities, and decentralized financial institutions and solutions. And also without that, right? Just with technology and digitization alone. The ability to grow the private market is on the horizon. Regulators around the world are rushing to catch up and understand how to protect investors who want to participate in this market. This book reviews the regulatory, technical, and societal changes to open this asset class to more investors in the future. It's a great book. I read it myself. It came out in 2021, but you could go cop it. I think they do have the digital or Kindle form. So I just kind of wanted to go over that for a little bit because talking about great companies like Tesla or great companies like SpaceX, which is a private company, it becomes interesting. Why would you want to invest in one of the greatest aerospace companies in the entire planet? It just seems crazy. Plus, it's going to be a major internet provider in the future. Again, I'll have to be specific about this one, guys, but Elon Musk for the win. Recently, the Starship 6 was launched. It was a successful launch. It wasn't able to come back to the launching pad because of just some issues in general. But net net, hopefully they're going to do another splash landing in the ocean, and etc. And the booster will fall in the ocean. And then they'll do another one where they're actually are going to catch it on the tower, according to Elon Musk. And so again, I'm going to allow you guys to watch this great video and just sit back and think. You used to own sneakers, you know, Converse's or jewelry or even just a Sudan in a car. Now, this is what you could possibly own, an aerospace company. Only in America. FTS, FTS go. Props, go. ABI. GNC. GNC go. 